Alright guys, we're going to try the first mask horrific vision. We'll try to get ourselves the second mask. You get the first one by just finishing a full five chest run. Um, this is where I'm at in the skill tree. We're at cloak rank 10. Um, we're going to buff up inside. So yeah, let's take a gander. Probably going to play it a little on the safe side, uh, but definitely want to get the first mask from finishing the Valley of Wisdom. So let's go ahead and throw on this first mask. Long night, uh, maximum sanity reduction, 50%, down to 575. Increased mementos, enemy damage, 25%, enemy health increase, 25%. So that's not too awful. Uh, the worst thing is that sanity reduction. But we're still going to get 200 back from the mini bosses, so uh, the Valley of Wisdom should be quite uh, fantastic because there's three mini bosses in there. Uh, we are going to flask up, we're going to food up, and we're going to get started. I'm going to uh, clear the left side, see what our good flasks are, our good potions are. Uh, those hundred sanity potions are going to be even more doubly valuable since we have only 575 but oh that's out <laughs> talk to Rathion to start the adventure guys not the portal outwards Alright, so here we go. Oh, let's put our mask back on. Hee hee hee. Good decisions, kids. Good decisions. Pay attention and be smart. Alright, here we go. Let's get that second mask. Pretty confident. Play it safe. Alright. Here we go. Ooh, sweet. Desynchronization buff. Pull this joker. Disengage back here. Pet on defensive. Uh, blue is bad, Viles. Blue is bad. Alright, misdirect. There's a noticeable difference in health, but not too bad. Shouldn't lose too much sanity here. You get all these guys gathered up. You can probably peek your head back outside and finish clearing. I'm gonna go ahead and clear these two uh, mini bosses. Pop my cloak. Both those guys are doing break spirits. Save my interrupts. Serpent sting action. Did interrupts. All right, let's get this chest, and let's go ahead and use this speed buff to GTF out of here. I'll grab that chest on the way back. What is this? Blue is bad, so black is good. All right, here we go. Just did buy myself the free res talent on the tree this tier, so it's not things aren't quite as pressing. Let's cool down this guy. Get out of the way. Pop my eagle. He's doing his boomerang ability. Alright, 200 sanity back. We're looking good. Let's mount up. And as Fred Durst would say, get rolling. We pop my cheetah right through this door because mounting up doesn't seem to be worth it. I still have my leftover coordinated assault from the boss. Here comes the vision. I don't see any potions. Just working on these jerks. Even with 25% increase, it doesn't seem to be like damage is uh, the serious issue here. 
Sanity loss and time spent. Purple vial is good. Blue is bad. Blue is bad. Focus on these stupid appendages. Oh, my cloak is still on cooldown. Potion here. Blue is bad. Here comes another split personality. I was standing in a void zone there. I'm going to take a peek around here for bonuses. There's a crystal. Just want to wait until that next split personality comes. There we go. Now I'm going to melt the boss. So 25% increased health. Shouldn't be too big of a deal. A little bit of sanity reduction there. I'm playing a little fast and loose with uh, the sanity because I know I have that free res. But he's dead. Here comes the split personality that I wasn't paying attention to. Should we grab this chest? harder to see the split personalities with your sanity low but you can oh the blue was bad ate a blue and that was a not a good plan not going so great blue is bad blue is bad here's a green one and another green one I'm gonna go ahead and pop my first orb right here I got three seconds left two one Woo! <laughs> Talk about cutting it close. I'm getting the most out of our orbs. In a perfect world, I would have gone down this hill and dropped it right about here. We got a visions coming in, split personality. So I could kill these guys inside the orb. But, say la vie. Blue is bad. Blue is bad. Blue is bad got over here we got red here comes the split personality I tend to trap this guy and then I go kill his buddy so that I don't get stunned and then we can beat up this jerk keep an eye open for cool stuff there's a potion in there it's black Black is okay, so we'll drink that. Alright. Working our way across here. Misdirect. I'm going to pop my cloak here, which is probably a mistake because you definitely want to try to have that available for the boss. Blue is bad. Don't drink that. Let's try to stay moving on this boss because he does stupid ground things. Here comes another vision. Still have our free res. All right, this is probably enough sanity to save or kill that boss, especially with cooldowns. You know, perfect. Mm, not quite sure why I have all the sky effects. I'm still at half sanity. We have 47 seconds left. We are going to go ahead and pull this guy. Our cooldowns. Step out of the way, use Gale Callers. He's about to hit me with something, but I'm just going to take it. Oh, nice. This guy is hands down the worst. Normally I just try to melt him and deal with the ads later. All right. Here comes no. Nope. It's a pulsating blue, and that's just part of the sanity mechanics. The cr 
creeping purple is the other one. So that's done. That's a success. That means we're going to get our second our second mask even if we don't finish the boss. Well, maybe we have to finish Thrall, not positive. Probably will, but... There's our, another odd crystal over there. There's a black potion down there. We're looking at seven seconds, so we're going to go ahead and orb here and pull this group into it. Make sure my pet lets them come back to me. Oh, sweet. This buff is nice. It often comes at very useless times, however, I find. I'm about to go run up and get this crystal. I probably should have used this debuff to hop on the boss. The little mini boss is in here. I'm not sure what causes her. to spawn or not spawn. Make sure you keep your jumping action on. Mental Assault. I'm pretty sure Mental Assault is only a damaging ability. It doesn't cause any sanity loss. So purple liquid here. Blue's bad. Purple's fine. We're going to go upstairs here. Ooh, purple's the good one. Free sanity. Looks like we pulled that pack, but it really doesn't matter too much. Gonna hop off here. Melt these little void globules. I beat their big brother to death. Stunned. Feeling pretty good about this run so far. Might be able to do the second medium objective as well. We're only well we've used two orbs already, probably not. I'm gonna go ahead and get these guys going because I have my buff. Stupid eyeball. Now we'll go get a chest. Grappling hook up to these dodos. See a little potion peeking out there in the back. Pretty sure we have enough sanity to melt this boss. I think I'll probably get that third bonus objective done. We're going to get 200 sanity from this guy. We're going to get 200 sanity from the second mob in the next zone. And with the third orb, that should hold us over. We do go ahead and cool down this guy. All out. He's going to hit us with hopelessness. Hopefully he doesn't go too far away. And he's got another hopelessness. That he conveniently dropped right on top of us. Thanks, buddy. Let me just peek my head inside this window for odd crystals. Score. I'm not sure if the multiplication bonus from the mask adds on to the crystal bonus. But if it does, that'll be fantastic. this bad boy open. Still got our buff. Gonna get over here and show this tentacle what for. Cooldowns are not yet up for this mini boss, but luckily he is more annoying than anything else. I watch those ground target effects. They have a very short timer. This guy's going to give us his 200 sanity back when he dies. It's very nice. Check for potions while we wait on Garona. Wake up! And we focus this 
Blue is bad. There's a blue potion there they're trying to troll us with. No, thank you. Both of those guys are hitting my pet, so I'm going to go ahead and open this door. Got a corruption. Or a gift to the Titans. Oh, I didn't jump enough. Crack open this door. Another blue potion, man. They're really trolling us with those blue potions. Other than that, we're going to check this building. Oh, hey, look. Chest. So long. Thanks for all the chests. Vision's getting low. Starting to yell at us. We are probably going to pop our third orb right before this boss and then make sure that we're going to thrall ASAP so we still have our free death ability which in addition to being a freebie will give us back almost full sanity because uh, we have only have 575 as a max. So so we're going to hit this orb. We're going to wait a minute until we're charged up. And we're going to go in guns a blazing. Go get him pit. Pop some cooldowns. We're going to try to keep the DPS up while we dodge this Void Torrent. Ah, that worked really well. Check for another crystal inside this building. There it is. I'm going to go ahead and kill Misha, or whatever the name of that bear is in the next zone, just for some extra mementos and the fact that it will give me 200 sanity back. So I might as well use it blank. I don't know how nasty Thrall is going to be, but I'm going to need a minute or two on my cooldowns also. So this is a good way to kill that time. We got Vision coming. Split personality. And we'll have Bloodlust up for Thrall. And this gets us another crystal, which is nice. Make sure we go turn those in. Here comes another hallucination, split personality. All right, so we're going to go ahead and green is good, blue is bad. And the green is the good one, good one. Oh, nope, split personality come in. All right, let's go ahead and take the portal back. We will turn in our crystals, and then we will uh, kill Thrall. Not sure what the difference is between my pet despawning or not despawning when I take that flight. Helps to be back on your first action bar so that your spells work. Gift of the Titans. That was 100 sanity bag. That's nice. Alright, let's go turn in our orbs and then we'll make quick work of this last boss. I don't know. I think this desynchronized mumbo jumbo may be my most hated. I found six crystals. Wow, really? That's impressive. Let's see how many mementos we get out of this. 195, that seems to be the same amount. And maybe the bonus multiplier works differently. Alright, so we got cooldowns available, we got bloodlust, and we don't have to deal with the void dogs because we didn't kill Rexar, so this should be simple. I'm gonna go in, cooldown, 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 and we'll bloodlust. Cups 
hopelessness. Should try to hit us with that defiled ground. Still on almost full burst mode, so. And there we have it. 12.38, it's not quite as many as doing a full clear on no masks, but it's good. Now we have the faceless mask of the burn bridge. Hot diggity. 180, 360 mementos. 220 those side quests side chests normally give 300 and these give 150 so 30 more 60 more out of the sides trying to do the math in my head to see if it's more valuable to do the other ones left us with 4700 not quite enough for our next thing let's go back in and turn in the mask so we can see what that bad boy looks like. Hello? Yes? Requires... Oh. I can't go in and turn my quest in unless I have a vial. That is lame. Alright, well guys, you turned it in inside the vision, but uh, you can't go into the vision unless you have a vial, so... Maybe later.